The fantastic film Tropic Thunder has received a massive amount of woke backlash and controversy over the past few years as we continue to fall into a society that is looking through the entire world through an intersectional woke type of lens. And now Ben Stiller is here to tell all those wokesters out there that screech to the heavens every time this film Tropic Thunder is mentioned, every time one of the actors in this film speaks about it. He is here to tell all of those people to pound sand in the most hilarious way imaginable. So Ben Stiller isn't sorry for making Tropic Thunder. I make no apologies and we need more of this type of stuff coming from Hollywood. I don't know why the people in Hollywood, these celebrities, these multi-millionaire people who have so much popularity, they don't even know what to do with all of it. I don't know why these people are afraid of a very minor selection of people on Twitter who have blue hair and basically are just a bunch of land whales who are screeching at them it doesn't make any sense why they are so intimidated by these type of people but they continue to prove that they are except for a few who are willing to take a stand against the the nonsense so hollywood star ben stiller isn't sorry he made the 2008 hollywood satire tropic thunder even in light of the character played by robert downey jr a method actor who undergoes skin darkening and other drastic physical alterations to play a black soldier in the movie within the movie it's so hilarious it's so meta it's fantastic so clever i love it but anyway ben stiller this person says please stop apologizing for doing this movie it was and still is funny af even funnier now with cancer culture the way it is it's a movie y'all can just get over it i was dying laughing when i first saw it back in the day and so was everyone else so and then Ben Stiller decided to just directly or, uh, respond to this person where he said this, I make no apologies for Tropic Thunder. I don't know who told you that. It's always been a controversial movie since when we opened. Proud of it and the work everyone did on it. So, and then this person pointed out a tweet that he made a while ago, like back uh, almost five years ago. Where he said this, actually Tropic Thunder was boycotted 10 years ago when it came out and I apologized then. It was always meant to make fun of actors trying to do anything to win awards. I stand by my apology. The movie Sean White and the great people who work of and the great people and work of the Special Olympics. So the confusion appears to have originated over a resurfaced 2018 tweet in which Stiller in fact did apologize for Tropic Thunder. Though his apology at the time seemed to address the blowback over the movie's other movie within a movie, Simple Jack, which is a, a thing that happened in the film, another meta thing in the film, and appear, it appears he's apologizing for that in the film, so technically he did apologize back in 2018 for it, so either Ben Stiller has a change of heart now, where now he realizes I don't need to apologize for this as we continue to get on the other side of all of the woke uh, nonsense that is happening, or maybe... You know, maybe he just uh, doesn't remember. Who knows? But the fact is that Ben Stiller is here to say that he makes no apologies, basically retracting what he said previously, and that is something that we need more people to be willing to do. More people who are willing to stand up against the woke mob and not continue to bend the knee to them. So, with that being said, let me know what you think about all this in the comments below. What do you think about what Ben Stiller has to say here? Hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.